Hi everybody, welcome back to our channel. Um, I am 34 weeks pregnant today and so I wanted to give you guys a little update about how the pregnancy is going. And um, a little later, Cooper is gonna be home from school and tell you all about how that is going. So um, let's get chatting about the pregnancy. <laughs> So first of all, if you guys aren't subscribed to our channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, we are getting so close to meeting this little sweet baby girl and uh, I can't wait for you all to meet her. Uh, before I go any further, look at that cute little pup. Gracie, hi. She's really sad. She misses her brother when he's at school, like really misses him. <laughs> uh, but she's so good when he's gone to just lays down, it's so nice. Anyway, uh, so I went to my diabetes doctor yesterday. As you all know, I have gestational diabetes, and um, my numbers have been so good, you guys. I don't have to go on medication as of yet. I'm able to be controlling it with my diet, so I'm super excited. Um, and also, they said that I only have to start checking my blood sugars twice a day now instead of four times a day. So that is like such a relief because my fingers are just like gonna fall off from pricking them so much. Um, what else? That was really big news yesterday. I was really excited about that. I'm actually heading to my doctor in just a few minutes for another non-stress test. I've been going every week for that. So we get to listen to the sister again. Uh, it's my first time going without Cooper. So it's gonna be kind of relaxing. I might take a nap. I don't know. Okay, I had to sit down because my arm is getting tired. <laughs> Everything makes me tired now. Um, anyway, I am excited to go hear her heartbeat and make sure she's okay. I have actually started having contractions almost every night for the last four nights. So I'm um, kind of nervous about that. I'm gonna talk to my doctor about that today and see what she says. Um, it's just kind of making me nervous that she, uh, not my doctor, but the baby, might come a little earlier than I expected. Um, with Cooper, I never had a contraction, ever, um, until they induced me. And I only had like two contractions and his heart rate dropped so much when I'd have a contraction that they stopped and did a C-section and that was it. So the contraction thing is really new to me. Didn't experience it at all last time with Cooper. And uh, just everything about this pregnancy has been different than my first pregnancy. But um, yeah, everything is going good so far. She's head down, had an ultrasound last week. I think I talked to you guys about that, but she is head down. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm thinking I should probably pack my hospital bag and her bag and get her car seat in the car just to be safe because I feel like she could come maybe within the next couple weeks, who knows, which is kind of crazy. I can't even imagine, but um, yeah, I my one problem I'm having with my diabetes is that this local store here got these pumpkin chocolate chip cookies in that I'm not kidding you guys, every fall I buy, I like buy the store out. They're so good, they're my favorite cookies ever. And they're in right now. And I went and bought a box, which was so dumb. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I bought two boxes. Um, it was so dumb because once I had one, I was like, well, now I gotta eat all of them. <laughs> so um, that's, you know, not gonna help my numbers, but I have been trying to sneak them in between lunch and dinner. I find out that, or I found that that is my best time to sneak a craving if I'm having it because it doesn't affect my numbers too bad. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna head to my doctor and then I will let you guys know what she says today. And then we'll go get Cooper from school. I can't wait to hear about how his day is going and have him tell you guys how he's enjoying school. So let's go. Okay, so I just got back in the car from seeing my doctor. And the baby was good, non-stress test was good, her heart rate was perfect. Um, as long as I'm still just having contractions at night, I'm fine. If I start having any during the day and night, I have to go to the hospital. So, you know, that's a little uneasy feeling because right now everything's fine, but it could change quickly. So I'm like, huh, we better get prepared for this little girl. Um, 
but so far so good and I got really hot in there my face is like red I got so hot in there um, anyway, I'm on my way to pick up the Coopster from school, so we will see how his day was when we go get him. Hi, Cooper. Hey! Cooper's home from school. Hey. How was your day? Good. Good? What did you do today? I drank. You drank some water? Mm-hmm. What else did you do at school? I... <laughs> I did. Did you guys play? Yeah. Outside? The paper. And you did paper? What did, What number did you learn about? The number E and starts with elephant. Letter E and elephant starts with E. <laughs> and so tell everybody about your friends. What? How many friends have you made at school? Three. Three? What are their names? I don't remember two, but all of what? I don't I don't remember two, but oh Scott. You remember Scott's name? He has a friend named Scott. And Cooper like killed me this morning with a joke. He said he calls Scott Smalls. Like the guy in the damn lot. Scotty Smalls. Like you're killing me, Smalls. I'm like, does Scott like you to call him Smalls? Or does he know you call him Smalls? He knows? Does he like it? He does? <laughs> oh my gosh. Tell everyone what you did with my money today. So I had a $100 bill sitting on the counter this morning. And I came home from dropping Cooper off from school and I could not find it anywhere. Like I was searching, ransacking the house. I couldn't find it. I started crying. I'm like, where did this $100 go? Tell everybody where it was. In my piggy bank. Why was it in your piggy bank? Cooper took it and <laughs> snuck it in his piggy bank and didn't tell me. And I was like going nuts looking for this money. <laughs> and he loves some, he loves him some Jello, huh, Cooper? After school snack. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, thanks for the riveting conversation. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Cooper wants to go get ice cream. But no, I'm going to fill my ice cream, Mom. Yeah. Jello, and then he wants to go at ice cream. He's on a health kick. <laughs> All right. Love you. So Cooper got some ice cream, but it is a torrential downpour here. Thunder, lightning, pouring down rain. Perfect ice cream weather, huh, Coop? <laughs> oh my gosh, it is like just pouring. I felt like I was driving through a river. <laughs> oh well thank you guys for watching our vlog today and um if you liked our video give us a big thumbs up and we will see you guys next time say bye cooper bye.